What is going on guys? Brimix here. As you guys can tell, I'm in my Mercedes C-Class. I'm going to show you guys how to black out your uh, chrome trim in your Mercedes. Um, so yeah, let me show you how it looks right now. And let me show you how it can look. Alright, so I still need to uh, black that one out, but I'm sure you guys how it looks before. Close the door, and this is how it looks before. I already blacked out that mirror. I'm not gonna keep it. Though. I'm gonna take it off. But this is how it looks, chrome, obviously. I'm gonna show you guys how to make it to the black one. All right, guys. So step number one will be to remove the chrome piece. You can't really uh, vinyl wrap it when it's on the car. So I'm gonna show you how to remove this. Uh, and two, I'll show you guys how to uh, vinyl wrap this. Like I said, I'm not perfect at it, so obviously you might get a little bit of some imperfections, but you can't even see them because it'll mostly have it inside, which is okay. You know, they're not gonna see it, but from out here, it's gonna look really good and uh, blacked out. So that's what we want. So let's get moving this uh, trim piece right here. You have this piece right here. Let me get my screwdriver, but you wanna break this, or not break it, but take it out. I'll show you how to take it out. And then you also got another one in here, which you can see right there. I have my flathead screwdriver. And of course you're gonna need Sour Patch Kids. But let's get the screwdriver and on, show you how to undo this. Clip right there. Bring it out like that. Oh, there you go. Obviously, you want to save that. Put it right here. And then the interior one, same thing. You're gonna want to stick it in here. You won't be able to take it out unless you obviously remove the trim piece right there. It's coming out. You just want to get it in with the screwdriver in like this. It should just pop out. There you go, like that. This one, I think this one's kind of long. It shouldn't be too long, but you want to bring it out. Oh my god. There you go. Now, so you take it out. Obviously, pick it up again because you're going to need it. Put it back. Dang it. Where'd it go? Okay, here you go. You wanna save it because you gotta pop it back in. Throw it with the other one. And now to remove this one. Stick the screwdriver in here. You wanna see a railing. You wanna pretty much put it in there and lift it up from the railing. Slowly, you don't wanna break it like that. Careful not to bend right here because these tend to bend a little bit right here when you're doing that. Try not to do it ho too hard. All right, guys. So, like, you want to have to do. I don't know if it'll focus. Just put the screwdriver in here, into the railing, lift it up a little bit. There you go. It's kind of focusing a little bit. So you lift it up a little bit until this part kind of pops out, like so. See right there. After that, literally, you're done. Put your hand here. Pick up. Okay, kind of hard to do it with one hand, but I'm gonna try to carefully place it. Don't scratch the carbon fiber. Okay, here we go. Lift it up. What's up, guys? Oh. Okay. Now let me set it down. See if I can put it somewhere where you guys can see it. What I'm doing. So, what you want to do is, yeah. 
go from where you left it, literally pick it up. Boom. There you go. It's easy. Just gotta be careful right here when you whenever you're putting it in the railing, you don't want to bend it because this bends a lot easily. I learned trust me, I learned that on the other side. But this side, I was more careful, I didn't bend it. And then since it's not raining, I can just leave it like that. And you're done, I guess, this side. Now it's to the front door. All right, guys, so for the front door, same thing. You have a black. Maybe I can do it with my nail. Ouch. Okay, maybe not. Let me get the screwdriver. But this is how it looks without it, guys. See, I kind of put it in there. It's scraped the paint a little bit, but you're not even going to be able to see from there. Where's the screwdriver? Oh, duh. Want to put it in here? That piece comes out easily. And then you also got another one at the end that you want to take off. This sits on the railing. Oh, my nails. There you go. Pause right out. This one I'm going to put it in here in case I got to go driving again. And then the front one, this is a big one in here. Oh, looks like mine didn't come with it. If I focus. Okay, but yeah, it didn't come with mine. The front one mine's. God damn. Yeah, I know. Alright, for this one, put it in the railing. Literally just lift up a little bit. You can already see it go up. Oh, how easy that is. Just don't scrape your paint. Actually, I don't care about this door because I'm already getting painted. Look, it's damaged. But still, don't want to paint yours. So, literally put it right there. Alright, so for this part, it's a little more tricky because you do have the side mirror here. So you have to pick up from here. You can't see because this dumb mirror is on the way. But, um, pick it up from here. Start picking it up until you get it off of the railing. Alright, so once you get to the point where you can't pick it up no more. So once you get to this point, guys, where you guys can't pick it up anymore, because the mirror is here, literally just grab it, grab it hard, and pull it. Okay. Come on, door. There you go. Pick it up a little bit. Pick it up a little more, and pull it. Okay. God damn. So start pulling. Okay. You're gonna see it sliding off. So do that until the whole thing comes out. Alright. That's how you remove your window trims. All right, guys, there are no sports on, but they're having this playing in the background. But that it focus, you guys can see. I have it here. I already let me turn this down before I get caught. All right, guys, so as you guys can tell on this one, I already wrapped it. You guys can see it's a uh, gloss black. This one is still uh, chrome. Oh, look, also got a uh, backup camera. So I'm gonna be installing this on the W204. And then let's install, uh, actually, let's black out the chrome I have here, the film. I'm gonna show you guys how I did this one. I honestly think this one came out better than uh, the other two I did. So it looks beautiful. So let's go install this. I gotta install this by tonight because it's gonna rain. As you can see, this is a little squeegee area that prevents water from going inside. 
I want to get it before it starts raining. So let's uh, black this out real quick. All right, now that we got both already uh, blacked out, let's go to the car and install these. It's gonna be nighttime, so it's gonna be hard for you guys to see. But I'm gonna try my best. All right, guys, we're at the side. And uh, here's the weird one we're gonna install right now. I don't doubt if you guys are gonna be able to see anything. But it's best to close the door. And yeah, you guys can't see nothing. So I guess I'm just gonna have to kind of see right there. Just put it on like that, push it down, that's it. So let me do it real quick. All right guys, I don't know if you guys can tell it's in. I'll show you guys tomorrow morning how it looks. But yeah, I mean, I guess you guys can kind of see a little chrome and then you don't see chrome there. But whatever guys, let's go. I'm gonna go in, it's late, late at night. So I wanted to come out and install it. But let's go, here's the starlight. All right. See you guys, I'll be right out here in tomorrow morning, so. Alrighty guys, it's the next day. As you guys can see, it's on the trim. I don't know how the scratch came here, but apparently it's scratched. Now we're gonna work on this side right here. These dogs won't start barking. Yeah, so from start from here all the way in here, so let's start by first measuring how much we're gonna need. Because we got this much. Alright, so I kind of skipped forward everything pretty much as I did. You can see I wrapped it up here. I'm not the best. You can see imperfections. This is just a pro protective uh, film. But here I am just uh, cutting it out right now. You can see with the blade. Also, I did mess up right here. Uh, I can't fix it really. Uh, but, I mean, for the second time doing this, I did a decent job here. Uh, as you can see here, I, this is just a protective film. All of this, so I'm gonna take it off. Finishing it right here. And uh, I'll show you guys the final uh, final outcome here. And I still gotta do with these chrome parts here, and then the rear doesn't have any. Oh, it does, but I'll show you in a second. It's like a snake, you can see peeling off. And there you go. Let's close the door. Show you guys how the blackout looks. Show you guys the before. I'm gonna close the door. And this is how it looks before. And then here's the after. It's on both sides. chrome except down there though I gotta do right now